this is the office of the Glimmer Glass, all of that student newspaper. My name is Joe Benz. I'm the faculty sponsor for the paper. We're putting together the next issue of the paper. This is John Small, the executive editor of the Glimmer Glass. John, what is it that you're working on here? Well, right now we're typing uh, stories into the computer so that we can typeset the stories. Um, eventually we'll take the stories and put them through the printer and lay them out on the pages so that the paper can be sent to the printer to print up the actual newspaper. How many editors do you have helping you on the paper? Well, there are four section editors, uh, one for each uh, section, news, features, uh, opinions, and sports, and then one assistant editor. And, uh, this is an especially important year for the Glimmer Glass. Can you tell us what is happening this year? Well, this year is the 50th anniversary of the Glimmer Glass. Uh, the student newspaper was founded in 1940. At that time, it was called the Olivet News, and it took on the name Glimmer Glass the following year. So what we're doing is we're using this year as a, as a means of uh, kind of a rebirth. We've ex expanded the page size. We've done a lot of redesign techniques, and we want to just create a paper that really reflects the Olivet community and, and the Olivet community can take pride in the, in the publication. After the editors finish at the computers, they will bring the stories over here to the layout board where uh, all the stories are laid out. The Glimmer Glass covers all areas of student life, from the major news stories to a wide variety of student opinions, to all of the sports coverage, to features about uh, special people and events at all of that. We invite you to come down to the Glimmer Glass office, meet the editors, and pick up a copy of the paper. We are located in the basement of Ludwig Center. So um, until we see you there, I think I'll just uh, take a look at the brand new Glimmer Glass.